Full speed ahead, damn the torpedoes, lads! Hello, my friends, welcome in. Um, we're still bottom of the table on 19 points. I, I As a content creator, one of the things that you hate, and, and it's a genuine hate, is that when you record an episode, you get punched in the face repeatedly by the teams that you play. And then you go off screen and you dominate. Dominate is a word. <laughs> but two, three, one wins. Okay. 40th minute, 62nd minute. They come back. It's two, one little nervy. We come right back and score substitute appearance for Joel. Then we beat IF Sylvia. We go up two nil, give up a goal in the 54th minute and get a penalty at the end of the game. This one honestly disappointed. We were up 2-0 in the seventh minute, and we could see two goals to finish out the half, and then nothing doing. But again, IF Karlstad Football was in first place at the time, and still is by nine points. So, despite the fact we picked up seven points, we've only improved our station by, I think, like two points. We're now five points from the playoffs. And we are six points from safety. But you're saying there's a chance. What's changed, GHG? What's changed? Here's what's changed. Playing counterattacking football is not my thing. I'm not very good at it. Um, so we're not going to do it. And we're at a low enough level that I kind of hinted at it at the end of last episode. Maybe we'll just go run at people and go boogity, boogity, boogity. And that's what we've done. Now, has it helped? Yes, it has. What's helped? What's helped? We've gotten some players in. Only two. And we're paying for him. We got Noah Tilburg on loan from Trelleborgs FF, which is in the, the league above us, currently in eighth. He's a stud on our team. We're paying 120 a week plus essentially 250 a week because we're paying a 1K a month in loan fee. The board, not thrilled by that. He's got three starts and a 697 lads. I'm just saying, he's what we needed at right back. So we've solved. <laughs> oh, don't get injured. We've solved our right back problem, potentially. And then from, oh, someone at some point, many years ago, explained to me, the, is it o oi, like oysters or osters? I'm not sure. I'm sure he'll better in the comments. Again, from the league above us, we picked up Oliver Gustafsson um, j to give us some depth at midfield. He's not the best. However, however, what he allows us to do, my friends, he's the third best midfielder that we've got. Ooh, let's go back and look at him. All around decent, decent. Loves a deep line playmaker, kind of, kind of his thing, right? Tackling is an eight. Could play him on defend if we need to, but support deep line playmaker is his thing. Depth, we've not had quality depth. We've had depth at like one and a half and two stars at midfield. Now we've got three stars. So what that's allowed us to do, my friends, is this. We've gone Gagan pressing. Yes, yes, we've gone Gagan pressing. Um, this is essentially the stock setup for Gagan pressing, except, oh, hello. Um, it's my close friends checking in on my father-in-law. That's very kind of them. Um, he, he, this is day two that I'm recording this, so I'm not sure when the last time you saw an episode and what I said in that episode. Um, he's feeling a little bit better and, uh, of course, isn't taking any of this seriously. So that's great because he's lived overseas and had all kinds of, Horrible things that you take pills for before you go overseas. And it's, it's almost like, ah, this is nothing. It's like, kill me, bro. Um, hopefully not literally. Um, so, yeah. So, this is essentially the stock setup for custom gig and pressing. With the only change, I think, being we have said distribute to the fullbacks, not to our center backs. I would say, like, distribute to our one center back who's good. But if you look at them all, the fullbacks are the better option. Um... I think we added tighter marking, but everything else is pretty much stuck. I'd taken pass into space off because I think our decision making and ability to run onto balls in space is not very good. But then our assistant manager was like, no, 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 we should do that. And I'm like, eh, okay. And he also recommended tighter um, uh, tighter marking. This was a ball winning midfielder and a box to box midfielder. Gustafsson, not as good as that. So we're going to put him on the on the deep line playmaker, kind of help out with this, uh, you know, wing back getting forward situation. 
Um, and it also gives somebody, you know, Brahimi can go run around and like wreck people's faces and Gustafsson is still hanging back. So it's not like we have a box to box that's getting forward and, you know, he's caught out of, out of position here and Brahimi's all running around by himself, you know, going crazy. That's what happens. We, yeah, that cursor is what happens when you play ball wing and midfielder. It also allows us to play Jakobsen, who again, it's not his favored role, but he's, he's still it, it, trying to get the best players on the pitch, right? Oistiak sticks on the inside forward instead of the inside winger because that's what it recommended we do. Uh, Marwan Badar is going to play an inside forward because he's been asked to. So come on in, son. Uh, Noble knows the, the pressing forward pretty well. What this also allows us to do, right? We're getting pressing everybody, but allows us to go after those back lines, which generally speaking, aren't very good at this level. So that's been our setup, and it hath worked, my friends. Two 3-1 victories, and then a 2-2 against top of the table. Of course, that means today against 12th and now 8th Carlsberg. Look out, lads. Um, we're going to lose both games 2-0. I can just feel that coming, but it's like, it, this has been magical. Dynamics have improved. Like, things have been great. And look, I mean, look, oh, look, look at the options for replacement. We don't even have anybody really on the bench that can play right back right now. Talebi, two-star. Uh, Cedarkvist, who did bang in a goal in one of our games, I think. I think. He's got two to his name, so I think that happened. Um, and Naram Sin Akademir, all two stars. So we replaced those two stars with a four star, my friends. We didn't get the goalkeeper. You know, we kind of said, well, eh. It's also, from a finance standpoint, to get to the six grand, we needed to loan the player for essentially six months. Um, they they adjusted the, the wage budget, but we're still under budget. We got a lot of budget left for next season. I'm not dealing with that. That's not my problem, boys. Um, can we go? This is, this is a six-pointer, people. If we can get a win here and catch up on the team that is currently safe, that would be massive. What if we won this game? We have 22 points. 22 points. It'd be crazy. We'd only be three points off of them now. The other teams could jump them. But, like, this is a massive game. Now, 6-4 to four odds versus 13-8. We are at home. Make sure you're tired nervous. I've built this thing up, haven't I? If you don't feel built up right now, I don't know. You're not breathing. And it, and it also, Gagan Preston has the goalkeeper on attack because of the high line. So, hoo -hoo hey! <laughs> Let's try it. Oh, we've built it up. Please don't. Don't waste my build up. Okay, they're playing a 4-2-1-3 double DM, which is curious. Uh, let's go get revenge. Risky thing to say, but I figured of all the times it would actually motivate our squad. But, you know, you never know. We got a ball winning midfielder. He may get a straight red in the first three minutes, and then I'm going to regret everything. Let's turn the sounds back on. Yeah. Um, Brahimi. Can he ping one in? He does. Gustafsson. Oliver Gustafsson. Or is it Olivier? I think it's Oliver. That's Oliver Gustafsson. Third minute. Fourth minute. Whatever. Doesn't matter. We've got a goal. First goal with the club. Welcome, Oliver. Good job just backpedaling into that one. That's difficult, right? Like, to backpedal and still get a little itty-bitty power on it. Mostly power coming from the, you know, the person, Brahimi, uh, the person, the player, that uh, pinged it in. But it worked. Oh, you know what I didn't do? I forget to do this when you all are here. I get so excited. Okay, generally looks pretty bad. Generally looks pretty bad. Generally looks pretty bad with the ball at their feet is essentially what I'm looking at. This guy can dribble, so... Let's make sure he doesn't get the ball. Okay. Right, right. He's decent at passing and first touch. So we're going to do that. Let's just try that. And then everybody else, like, nor Gagan press as normal. Because with, with them having five, uh, six players with the DMs all kind of together, I don't think closing down everybody's going to make sense because we're going to be leaving people open. But if we can stand next to the really good ones and then, you know, per the normal team instructions... I didn't even get a chance to pick. Okay. Because it popped up for a second, but immediately jumped through. It's Brahimi, who has a 10 on penalty taking and an 8 on finishing. And he slots it home. I would have picked our uh, striker, who is a 12 on finishing and an 8 on penalties. But Brahimi slots it home. Uh, but what I was saying is, with those six players, if, you all, if you're running around at everybody, I feel like that's going to leave somebody open. Versus like just tightly marking the ones that are good um, with the ball at their feet. And then using the normal team instructions to naturally run at people like when it makes sense rather than saying always run at them in my head makes more sense now we've had eight shots to their one but only two on target not the best we've had a clear cut chance of two half chances it's amazing what happens to your mood 
when you when when you win a couple games and we've just slotted home our third goal in 26 minutes, lads and la lasses. I, I still go ladies. I think lasses sounds better. Lads and lasses. Look at that. Oh, that was I'm right at the keeper. I don't know what the keeper was doing there. Maybe old lady plays having been a keeper before can let us know, but maybe they're leaning a little bit the other direction. But I mean, we got a 3 0 lead. Half or not, uh, halfway. Uh, it's half an hour into the match is the is what I was trying to say, but it wasn't coming out. Blocked by Nordbeck because he's a legend. Noble brings it down. Ostoyek driving forward. Is he going to cut inside? No, he cuts the ball back. Okay, nice. Gets it to Alexander, who's way back. Brahimi, the ball winning midfielder, is a little high in comparison. He finds Tilburg. Is he onside? He is. Takes a touch. Over. Ostoyek. It's. F I'm really wishing those two other games that we got absolutely gobsmacked hammered in, we would have been playing this. Although, I think maybe you can argue we wouldn't have had the players. We wouldn't have had the right back, and we wouldn't have had anybody to play. I mean, Lindbeck could... Is it Lindbeck? Whatever, the like backup, backup midfielder now. Um, could maybe have done like a deep line playmaker, or maybe just a central midfielder on defend. But we definitely wouldn't have had a right back. But we are absolutely crushing this team that's in 12th. Now, let's not take our foot off the gas. I, I do wonder, like, in these situations, like, oh, it's 4-0, do I, do I substitute somebody because I'm afraid they're going to get injured? You know? Like, we're just going to say passionate, very happy, get out of the way, have a juice box, my friends. Off you go. Okay, Nordbeck, tight groin, immediately coming off. This is, I, I, I speak these things into existence, apparently. Um, Lindmark can play wing back. He's the one, he's the backup, backup midfielder, but he has... He's he can play like every position, like from midfield across and down. So we'll take Nordbeck out. That's going to be immediate because he he again we just got a good a right. It's five though. We just got a good right back. Let's not lose our good left back, please. That was ridiculous. That was ridiculous. We don't need to watch it. Let, let's yes, of course, sub him off. Tight groin. Thank you. It looks like he was coming back. So maybe if we take him immediately off, it won't be so bad, right? And it's like okay, maybe he's all right. He's all right, lads. He's all right. And then I want to take, this is, <laughs> this is crazy. Um, you're really the only person that could play the 10 and you are quite good. So you're going to come off. Uh, and I will, we don't really have anybody else that can play right back, center back. Yeah, we're going to risk it. We're going to do the double subage and, and try and take some really good players off. I, I am somewhat relieved, okay, that that we had that, you know, those three games. And I was like, oh, oh, oh. And then we've come in and we, we, we've absolutely, absolutely wrecked this team 6-0. That, to me, makes me, like, just as, a, again, as a creator, people will be like, oh, you know, how many times did you reload to get those three results? It's like, I didn't. I just went for it. And I started, again, I started thinking, I was like, man, the back lines here, if they're as bad as our back lines, if they're about as bad, or, I mean, oh, come on, lads. Um, then, then maybe just running at them like a maniac makes a lot of sense. And it does. So, um, again, getting the, the good right back and the, the midfielder definitely helped our scenario. So, um, this is insane. Like, this is insane. Six... One. Have they ever scored six goals in a game? I guess we'll find out. Wouldn't there be... I guess there'd be something in the uh, the inbox. It was like, most goals scored ever. I got. The, I just got to praise the team. I wish I could tell you how monumental that feels. Because, like, we've not been able to do that. I probably should have taken off Gagan pressing. Save our legs a little bit. But I didn't. Okay. Right. Nice block. Lindmark comes back. Helps out. He's playing left back, so that he is doing his job a little more centrally, actually, than he probably needed to be. Brahimi, can we get a seventh, Lutz? Maybe they know the record's six and they're wanting more. Stoyak plays it back to Lindmark. Lindmark getting some game time. Lindmark! Oh, that was a cheeky little clearance, wasn't it? A little fancy. Fancy pants. Brahimi. I mean, 
Look at that ball. We're helping out the goal differential too, for people. Helping out the goal differential. I just feel like I need to clap her for like another minute. What? I think we should let the team know we appreciate their efforts. Uh, Where's the, like, I do wish in situations like this, there's like the, the there's like a good win, lads. And like, you know, you played really well. And there's like, that was unbelievable. You're outstanding. I want to kiss you on the mouth. You know, like. The other games have been played, my friends. We are three points from both the playoffs and safety. Oh. And we've, look at the goal differential, could be massive to go, <laughs> it would have been, if we had a, what, okay, we, six goals, so negative 16, we've gone from negative 16 to negative 10, which, you know, could come into play here. We are now at least in the ballpark of goal differential. I'm going to go save, hello! Like, I would not have believed that if I hadn't been recording, right? Like, I'm so thankful that happened while recording that is insane that is insane you get to I'm, I'm i wanted to check on this so he gets a three-day rest rest that groin there martin seventh heaven does it say anything about goal records i could look it up i guess somewhere i never look at this uh that's about the team how about stats comparison no in there a thing like oh uh, maybe it's uh landmarks I don't know you'll tell me in the comments I guess let's hop forward yay let's go let's go people could we today okay let's let's think about this we're playing Carlsberg okay they're in tenth so we we it's I thought we were playing we just, Carl's Lund, Carl's Berg, lots of curls hanging out. But a win today, depending on the other results, could get us into a playoff spot or to 14th. Either way, would be not, look at this, we're, we're favored over a team in 10th. Is it, is it because of the quality of the players we brought in? Is that all that, the, that's all it took? That's all it took, lads. Let's go. Oh, we also have uh, Ludzik out on suspension. So Hesselheim comes in. Um... Probably just going to do no nonsense. Like, just get rid for him. No, no, not ever. Oh, I misclicked. Uh, normally this, but then for you, you just, you just hoof it. That's, you do you, bro. You do, you do you. Let's go. We brought a, another center back in on trial, but he's, let's just say a prospect for the future. Hold on a second. Okay, it was more than a couple minutes, but here we are. <laughs> Yeah, pick up where you left off. Let's freaking go, boys. Can we do it again? Can we just be that crazy team? Like, ah, here we go. Here we go. Nordbeck. Alexander back to Nordbeck. He's going to ping it in. He's going to ping it back to Gustafsson. Acres of space. Do something, bro. Look at that space you can dribble into. Instead, he just lines up a shot. Two minutes in. So you're saying there's a chance. We're taking down one of the Carls today. The BKs were bankrupt. Let's go. I was wondering, I was like, there's a gap, there's a gap there between the, the center backs or the defenders, whoever that was. I'm like, he could drive into that. Instead, he's like, mm, like the, the gif of the, the numbers. And then he just banged it home. And he just picked up a third goal of the season. Have we figured out the um, whatever division in Sweden we're in? Is that is that what's happening? No, I mean, I, I, maybe I should have skipped it. We just beat the last team 7-1, though, so... It, overconfidence? Is overconfidence an issue? Nah, it's fine. It's fine. Ostoyek. Ooh. Nord back. Oh. Sigerstrom. Okay, ball out wide. Okay. Defended it nicely. Easy. Love it. Brahimi to Alexander. Okay. Oh, he finds Noble. Nobel. No. Uh, 
we're, we've moved up to 14th. I was going to say, I'm not going to look until, like, I'm not going to go to updates. I'm not going to bring up the table over there. We're just going to, we're just going to see how it plays out. But where's this been, boys? It, it, was it just uh, getting a couple wins and dynamics is up? And then obviously, obviously changing the system. But like, you get a couple wins, dynamics changes, system is more aggressive. And like, boom, off we go. Like, is that, we just need a lot of spark? Is that all we need to do? I love that Jakobsen is already complacent 30 minutes of the game. He's like, eh, we got this one in the bag, boys. Like, like easy. Like, let's, let's, oh, Ostojek picks up a yellow. We may bring him off at the half and bring on Young, because Young is good too. And we don't want to go, you know, down to 10 and, like, start conceding. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Okay, we pull him out of position. That was all, it was all planned for Nordbeck to just stand there and watch our attacking midfielder, our number 10, drive all the way back to get that. Oh, he just misses. He just misses. We have two clear-cut chances and a half chance, boys and girls. Okay, that's fine. Things are fine. Doink. It's fine. It's fine. Didn't go in. It's fine. It was a little nervy. I was kind of watching that. We're not, we're not looking. We're not looking. Passionate. Very pleased. Keep it going. Keep it going. Keep it going. Keep it going. Full steam. Um, you know, who's actually better as the inside forward? Yeah, ooh, none of you. None of them. Um, oh, dear. Left footed only. He's our... And he's left footed only. He's not played as much though, so we'll, we'll bring him. We'll bring him on. It's fine. It's fine. Things are fine. Go out there, and make a difference. Go out there, and make a difference. Like score us another four goals, so we can get another seven goal victory. Work on that goal differential, huh? 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 This is crazy. They're playing with more caution, so we can just run at them like maniacs. Brahimi draws the defense out. Oh, that's a good switch to the field to get over to Nordbeck. Nordbeck takes a touch, sizes it up, gets it to Young, plays it. No, he doesn't play it back. I thought he was going to play it back. Kind of a poor cross. That's match sharpness, in my opinion. Because, he's got, again, he was, as of the start of the episode, the assist leader um, for the club. Oh, dear. Not a penalty. Not a penalty, not a goal. It's fine. Worked out just fine there, my friends. One worried one bit. Um... All right, you're looking tired and on a 6.6. .6. We'll bring in Joel... Come on in, Joel. See what you got. I mean, we don't want to take, take it for granted, right? Like, we, we've cooled off a little bit from the 30-minute surge that we had. Um, oh, dear. Mistake, but not stead is there. Tilburg. Okay, lovely. Hasselheim. Not Huff. Oh, not. Oh, dear. No-nonsense center back. You'd think a no-nonsense center back would just, like, have hoof that rather than dancing on the ball. But, you know, what do I know about things? Not a lot, apparently. You're looking knackered. Let's get you off. Because you're quite important. So we'll bring on your not great backup. One of the many. A whole host of them. Oh dear. Oh dear, do something, mate. I mean, you scored two, so... Like, I'm not trying to be harsh with you, but... Don't just stand there and let him continue to slide into your legs. Like, that seems like a poor healthcare decision. I like how Norbeck stuck at that one. That was... They're sliding all over the place. Gustafsson, back to him. All right. Calm, calm, boys. Okay. Ball point defender picks... Oh, my goodness! Picks out a pass to Joel Rajalaksu. Who relaxes it into the back of the net. <laughs> Deary. Hello. Oh, they're looking for offside, eh? Ooh, he was... Noble was probably offside, but it doesn't matter. It didn't go to him. Have we just erased in this episode 10 goal difference? And, and, and obviously gained six points. 
on top of the seven points in between this and the last episode. We'll talk about a resurgence. Oh, come on. Too much dancing on the ball, boys. Oh, dear. That's our backup. That's the backup I kind of... Uh, Hasselheim. Okay, keep it up, boys. Keep that goal difference. That's fine. We'll take that. We'll take that. It's fine. Things are fine. Just... Nice, Rose. Rose. It's probably like Royce. Something like that. Isn't the O, the Oi? In... Your performance has moved us out of the relegation zone. If there was ever a time to give that talk, it was then, right? Like, thumbs up for everybody there. Are you serious? We're in the playoff spots because of goal difference. Because we were at negative 16 and we're at negative 6 right now. We are one point from safety, friends. I mean, we're not, I mean, we're also one point from bottom. So it's like, let's not get ahead of ourselves. But like, we've done everything in this episode that we could have asked for. Holy cow. Look at that. What a turnaround. Now we take on second place. Now, to be fair, we did draw with first. Away from home, two to two. And took an early lead. So second. And then from there, 15th, 12th, 10th, currently fifth, and 16th. Winnable games on the schedule, potentially aside from this one. I cannot believe that. Like this is this is where we want to be, bare minimum, right? Like we, if we can get to the playoffs, I, if we kept this form, well, if we kept this form, I think we're going to win the league. No, we're not going to win the league. But I would, I would, I would, I would count on us not going down against a team in the division below us. I'd feel pretty confident about that. But I mean, we get a win. We could, we could be in. 12th or 11th we get another win like we could be jumping we're not we're not going to get anywhere near the top five but like we could be feeling a lot better about life look at the disparity here you get 40 points up and then you got seven points down and then it's only a nine point difference between sixth place and 16th that is insanity my friends seven days from now we're gonna play another game uh i'm gonna bring you back this will probably be how we do this we'll have two episodes to end the season Carlsland, and you can't see that, I guess. Um, so the last four games, Carlsland, I'll make it pop up over there. Carlsland in 12th, Vasilins in 10th. That'll be an episode. And then IF Broma Poyakarna in 5th, and BK Forward to finish the season. Hit that like button, my friends. We will see you then. Feel a little bit better. Again, can't get overconfident. We are just one point from bottom. But the trend is headed in the right direction. What do you think is going to happen? See you then.